Gregory Studios here with another collections video. This one is on both my Rebel and Imperial armies. Um, I'll start off with my Echo, well, actually Hoth sets. Got the Echo Base from 2009, two Rebel Trooper Battle Packs from 2010, and then two Snow Trooper Battle Packs from 2010. Got a total of five Snow Troopers. I would have six if I would have made a Galactic Marine, but I'm not sure I'd have them. And then you might be saying, well, the Zerin don't belong on there. Well, that's because they don't. They just put them on there because since I have two of them and two of the vehicles, I decided to put them on there because, they're, because their helmets and their faces are different from everybody else's. So, yeah. I mean, really different. So, yeah. It does that. And it kind of works. I like it. hope we get more of those somehow. Those mini figures, because I'm going to get more of those and I need more drivers for them. All right. Now, I'm going to skip the middle section for now and do this. Um, I have four elite stormtroopers that I made myself. All I had to do was put black arms on them. And then one shadow trooper. I would have two, but I can't find the other one. And I have this custom guy. He's like a commander from Endor. I guess you could say. He's one of my first uh, customs ever. He's actually the second, I believe, that I've ever made. And he's okay. Not that good, but okay. And then back here, I have a setup, if you remember, from episode 4, when Obi-Wan Kenobi uses the Jedi mind trick on the Sand Trooper. That's what I have here. He's... Yeah, just like that. R2-D2's following him. There's C-3PO, and there's the Sentry Droid. And there's Luke. Um, so yeah. Alright, now for the final section. Um, I have, uh, Darth Vader's Advanced TIE Fighter. You might be uh, you might be wondering why I'm moving the, this away. I'll explain it to you then. Um, then I got this. I made this out of two stormtroop battle packs. That's why I got the everything thing over there. Crap, basically. Um, it's pretty cool. It's kind of like a little escape pod or escort vehicle. My custom pilot in there two handles, and this piece. The only two things that I didn't get from that are, well, one, the hand for him. I made them, I put them white. Um, the piece that makes this go like this, and then the two pieces right here. Now I'll take him out and show you him. Right. So, he's pretty cool. Um, sorry, just trying to fix him. Oh. Alright, so, yeah, he's cool, he has stripes on his legs, um, it's colored in right there, it's colored in right there, and his helmet's colored in around, and then the back of his torso. So that's all he is, he's just a pilot, since I didn't have one, well, just figured out that I can zoom in when I'm actually taking a, making a movie, or video, whatever you want to call it. That's pretty cool. Alright. Alright, anyways, um, back to this. I'm gonna, just gonna put them back in, and then I'll move on. I can actually show you how to make this if you want me to. It's really easy, and you don't need that many pieces. Then there's my mini high fighter with the stand that I put on there. I already did a review on that, so you don't have to ask. And then, last but not least, the Home One Mon Calamari Star Cruiser set. My grandma, for my birthday, gave me $100, and, well, yeah, my grandma, but my grandpa, gave me $100, and this is what I got. I actually got it on sale for $79.97, I believe. Um, I have a setup of the, uh, the, 
sorry, but what he is, I think he's an officer, is walking over to Mon Calamar, or the Mon Mothma, and Lando, which is pointing at the hologram of Endor. Then over here, I have the pilots of the A-Wing going to refuel the A-Wing, and the Mon Calamari fixing the engine to the A-Wing. And the crane is attached to that. And yeah, I want to turn it around. Which, by the way, I might forget to tell you this in the review. This is actually the way out of the hangar. So it's pretty cool. Um, then there is Admiral Akbar. It's me, chair. I would put his coffee mug in his hand, but it looks kind of weird. So, yeah. Alright. Now, that's all that I have to say about my collection. I'm just going to put them back, and then I'm going to explain this to you. Um, so, next year, and I have obviously both started a contest, one for each uh, channel. And, well, I want to explain this. So... I w w we're thinking that you don't want to, you might not want to enter our contest because we want your email address. Well, the only reason we want that is so we can send you the um, trailer, nothing else. So yeah, we just figured that might be a reason why nobody, not that many people want to enter. Um, actually, I have a, quite a few views for mine, and yeah, so. Alright, so, yeah, it's been our Rebel and Imperial Collections video. This is Agoris Studios.